We are less than a week away from Election Day, and thousands of ballots are currently either in the mail or they're all, they've already been mailed. That's right. For a closer look at everything, how it's all shaping up for next Tuesday, here's Coin6 political director Ken Boddy. Well, this is my ballot, so it's not counted in the numbers yet. I'm going to wait a couple more days before I turn it in. But usually, presidential primary years tend to see a boost in voter participation. But with both candidates already decided, this year isn't seeing that normal boost. Let's take a look at the numbers right now. The last presidential primary was in 2020, right in the first months of the pandemic, but voters still turned out. I would imagine in Oregon that's because we have our vote by mail that made that process easier. 15% of the votes came in by the Monday, a week before Election Day. Again, that's in 2020. Now, in 2022, we had the primary in the governor's race, and that turnout number dropped down to 8% on the Monday before the election, nearly identical to what we're seeing this year. At the end of 2020, we saw more than a 50% turnout compared to just over 35% in 2022. Now, we spoke about these numbers with Multnomah County Elections Director Tim Scott, who says they expect the historical pattern to continue this time around. So we're anticipating that we'll see somewhere between 35 and 40 percent turnout for this election based on historical data. We do have several important races and measures to be decided in Oregon, including the Multnomah County DA and two big congressional races with national implications. We'll cover all of that on our Eye on Northwest Politics primary special. That's tomorrow night with me and political analyst, former state senator and political consultant Rick Metzger. Now, you've already got your ballot. I've already got mine. They do have to be postmarked by 8 p.m. on Tuesday election night. So be sure to get out there and vote. Be mm -hmm. part of those uh, turnout numbers. I, yeah. our, our vote by mail thing is just so great. I sit there, mm -hmm. you have a glass of wine, I have the pet, the booklet right there, take my time, I can look, uh, be informed when I'm voting, as opposed to being in a little thing and making those decisions. Right. Well, Jenny, yeah. in my case, it would be a uh, cold Oregon craft beer. Okay. But uh, what, we do have... What, whatever, <laughs> whatever gets you involved, right? Whatever. Oh, <laughs> but I like being able to study Study the ballots, yes. study the candidates, yes. and take your time to make your vote. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's great. that's good. All right, Ken. all right, thanks, Thank you. Ken. Yeah.